HMM. The Alhitheros class is a class of container ships consisting of 12 vessels built for HMM. The largest ships have a maximum theoretical capacity of 23,964 20 foot equivalent units. The gigantic ship has a length of 400 meters, is 61 meters wide with a draft of 14.3 meters. It is the loading capacity of 24,000 Teo. The mega carrier is powered by a wind GV engine with an output of 60,580 kilowatts. This enables the vessel to reach a speed of 22.4 knots. These exhaust gas scrubbers remove sulfur emissions out of the ship's exhaust gases, thus implementing the required worldwide guidelines. Rosenbauer Panther 8x8 The Panther 8x8 is at the top of the food chain, so to speak, nearly 1,500 horsepower, over 130 km per hour top speed, and 19,000 liters capacity for extinguishing compound. It's the combination of these factors which has made the Panther from Rosenbauer one of the most fascinating fire-fighting vehicles in the world of all time. With its 1,450 horsepower the vehicle can accelerate from 0 to 80 km per hour in under 25 seconds, while reaching top speeds of 135 km per hour. Up to 19,000 liters extinguishing compound can be transported, while the pump can output 10,000 liters per minute. Chemrock Chain Cutter Chain Cutter's patented cutting attachment Reduces wear and tear on the excavator swing gear and saves energy The EC range of chain cutters are the first of their type on the market Designed for use on excavators from 2 to 50 tons They are ideal for cutting stone with an uniaxial compressive strength up to 100 MPa They are efficient, vibration-free attachments for the excavation of deep narrow trenches with the optimal trench profile Trench width starts from 480 mm. Another application is mining of medium hard minerals with compressive strength from 15 to 60 MPa, where drill and blast is not possible. Et chain cutters reduce wear and tear on the excavator swing gear. In addition, they give a 40% energy saving for equivalent production rates compared to conventional rotary drum cutters without the central chain. Lee Pair LR13000 The LR13000 is the most powerful conventional crawler crane in the world. One of its main areas of use is power plant construction. This requires the continuous hoisting of extreme component weights. These requirements apply in refineries, as well, where industrial columns weighing 1,500t, 3,307,000 pounds, and measuring 100 meters, 328 feet, in length have to be erected. With individual maximum weights of 70 t, 154,400 pounds, this gigantic crane can be transported at low cost throughout the world despite its size. The LR13000 is the only crawler crane in this class which can also operate without derrick ballast. This is made possible by a slewing ring which our engineers have developed and which we manufacture in-house, featuring an extreme lifting capacity. Even the largest product in our portfolio can increase its lifting capacities using the power. Boom! Heron Neck HS2 Called High Speed 2, HS2, a high performance, Low carbon rail link is being built between the north of England and London. The first section of the British high speed line runs from London's Euston station to Birmingham. Departing from Britain's second largest city, the route will fork and, in phase two of the expansion, will run northwest to Manchester and northeast to Leeds. In the future, trains will roar along the route at up to 360 km per hour, faster than an ICE in Germany or the TGV in France. 
In order to reach these high speeds, you need dead straight routes and the most modern tunnel structures that pass under cities and towns, mountain ranges and other infrastructure. Around 100 kilometers of tunnels are planned along the entire route, also to preserve the beauty and biodiversity of the landscape above. NASA Crawler Transportation Vehicle A pair of behemoth machines called Crawler Transnegation Porters have carried the load of taking rockets and spacecraft to the launch pad for more than 50 years at NASA's Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Each the size of a baseball infield and powered by locomotive and large electrical power generator and negation HNS, the Crawler Transporters stand ready to keep up the work for the next generation of launch vehicles to lift astronauts into space. Weight approximately 6.6 .6 million pounds, or the weight of about 15 Statues of Liberty or 1,000 pickup trucks. Height varies from approximately 20 feet to 26 feet, based on the position of the jacking, equalization and leveling. Cylinders Load capacity able to transport 18 million pounds, or the weight of more than 20 fully loaded 777 airplanes. Pangolin Chandan Rock Arm Attachment The advent of the CSJ-300A series of Pangolin all-in-one hook arm fills the gap of the 30-ton excavator's rock arm, giving full play to the advantages of the 30-ton excavator's fast speed, and giving full play to its maximum value under the working condition that the requirements for excavating force are not particularly high. The forearm is cut from the whole piece of high-strength manganese steel, which reduces welding and processing. AN-225 Maria The AN-225 made its first flight on the 21st of December 1988 taking off from the factory aerodrome in Sviatoshin. Maria was developed for transportation of the Buran shuttle orbiter and components of the Energia carrier rocket. The AN-225 was also expected to be used as a flying space launching site in the reusable aerospace transport system with the airplane making its first stage and a small size space shuttle with a fuel tank, the second stage. Maria can deliver extra heavy oversized cargo to any point on the globe carrying it either inside the fuselage or on external stores. AN-225 type certificate is handed in during a new runway opening ceremony at Forestville Airport. Maria's first flight after reconditioning overhaul following a 7 years downtime on the aerodrome. Maria sets 124 world and 214 national speed, altitude and weight to altitude records, 